Hello, Railrunner66 here, today talking to you about the Vita Saw. The Vita Saw, in concept, is a life insurance weapon for when a medic can't really seem to live for very long or struggling for one reason or another. It is essentially trading your short-term survivability for long the long-term benefit. In the spirit of that, we changed it so that it is orientated around potential healing, namely just passive benefits, as was the nature of the original Vitasaw, along with some more active benefits in the spirit of the current iteration. Now, that's not to say that we weren't fans of the whole organs and uber-preserving mechanic. However, the only reason we didn't do that is simply because... In the current state of custom weapons, you can't preserve Uber. It's not something that can be done. It's been a problem with resupply cabinets, and even with the Vita Saw's mechanic, it will just simply reset with custom miniguns. So, we would have kept it, but with how things currently are, we could. Now, as for the rest of it, just a simple survival tool with just everything put out there for you, done over time healing as to make sure you're not dealing with a totally invincible medic, however, it can stack, so if per se you as a medic know how to prioritize who to heal or if you use the crits creep, for example, you can get up to some fairly substantial numbers and keep yourself alive quite long or you could switch to it while it's active and get the benefits from it and try to rely on it that way. It also encourages self-defense as a medic. Um, the only major problem would be some occasional issues with battle medics, but the reduced max HP somewhat discourages that. Overall, it's just a simple tool for when medics are struggling to stay alive in the long term. That's all it is. I don't really have much else to say about it other than I kind of wish the uh, organ mechanics worked for it, but oh well. I hope you can enjoy the changes, and I hope you have a nice day.